All right, let's clear all this up. Just step on it, kind of, and somehow that, that gets rid of it. All right. Get some money. Get some elf fruit. Probably do need to try to, to make some more health poultices. I don't know if I can make a full one, though. A regular health poultice just yet. Oh, that's right. Leveling up more again. Uh, magic... Uh, and dexterity, because why not? I don't think she needs any more cunning. Yeah, she's got enough cunning for a while. Ugh, expert herbalism, though. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see if I can get away with that. Oh, hell yeah! Arcane Mastery it is! Boom. Just up spell power. I assume that's for both uh, attack magic and for healing magic. So that probably works out very well for me. Once again, it's going to be one of those level ups that really just saves the day for me. <laughs> Makes things so much easier. At least I assume so. Anything in here? I don't want to miss anything. Nope, just that giant, like, old medieval base. You guys are attacking me through the door? I didn't think you guys were allowed to do that. And they, they punch. These warden corpses don't even have weapons. They're trying to punch me to death. I don't care, they're punchers. Hit whoever the fuck you want. They'll all die eventually. <laughs> they're doing more damage to Charles than to anybody else. That is rare. And you're still not even close to killing him. He's still over half. You guys were like focusing on him the entire time. And you still couldn't do it. You should be ashamed of yourselves. You are not wardens. You're not even up to the par that Alistair set. What the hell is wrong with you? Alright, uh, ability notes. What the hell is this? This appears to be s old research of the mage. Avernus or Avernus. Either way. They detail a series of experiments in terse clinical handwriting. Day 32. The subject is not responding to the stimuli. Testing the pain threshold has uncovered nothing. Only three subjects are left. Day 82. If only I could reproduce last night's extraordinary success. Electricity is only a catalyst. The blood is the key. Day 97. Energy and blood. Repeated applications have duplicated the results. I conjecture that success can be induced alchemically. But there are no more subjects left. If only I had one more, or a dozen, the things I could do. Okay, so... He's obviously doing some kind of blood experiments here. Oh, chemical concoction. Can I, can I drink that? This noxious uh, potion appears to be the combination of Avernus's horrific research. So in case you weren't clear, he's not doing, not doing good work. It promises to unlock the hidden potential of the tainted blood you drank during the joining. So then let's fucking drink it. That sounds good to me. Unlock my potential. I have hidden potential. This is just going to be like Dragon Ball Z with the Elder on Namek. Took me a while to... Pain wrecks my body, but there is power in this pain. And a hint of understanding. Took me a while to come up with the name Namek. You have access to new abilities. Sweet. What are my new abilities? Okay, where are they? Are they here? They are! Power of blood, which I can't seem to level up. Uh, tapping the power of tainted blood makes the rogue more nimble, able to move more quickly while using stealth, and more likely to dodge a physical attack. Well, I don't use stealth, but, you know, higher evades always appreciated. The rogue's blood gushes forth, coating the edge of weapons with a deadly taint. <laughs> Gross. This character gains a bonus to damage determined by the cunning attribute, but suffers continuously depleting health in return. Now, like I said, I already did this. As far as I can tell, the tainted blood, um, yeah, it's it's sustained and personal, whereas this is passive. So I actually have to turn this on. Uh, so I won't be because I'm not a big fan of you know sacrificing yourself for for more damage. But hey, you know, a small upgrade, a small ability, I will take it out huh. as opposed to nothing. You know what I mean? Yes, stairs, Charles. We've gone over stairs. 
<laughs> we're also going over chairs, but we're going over stairs again I today. Hear you. Don't disrupt my concentration. He's still alive? What the hell is with these fucking hundred year old guys still being alive? I don't, I don't remember how long ago Even it was. Even now the demons seek to replenish their numbers. Are you to thank for this welcomed but temporary imbalance? You're still alive! Only just. I have only a short time left. Your eyes are really Why are small. Why you here? What is your intent? Probably to kill you. Uh, yeah, give me my base back. Hmm. An admirable goal. But in order to achieve this, the demons must be cut off forever. Simple enough. I'm debating whether I should let you live. And here, I thought you would rescue me. No. There is a precise mystical balance here. My every breath is dedicated to keeping the tear in the veil from ripping wider. And you would kill me now. Your narrow-minded actions would ensure that this place teems with their kind. Fine, yeah, how do I get rid of the demons? Agreed. This must be the first priority. The only priority. You could have just said yes. I want some... I've seen your experiments. They were necessary. Any tool, any iota of information that could defeat the fell demons was justified. Worked out well As for me. As a warden, you should know that. Necessary. Having to relieve yourself after an eight-hour ride is necessary. But there's no excuse for summoning demons. Always oh, thinking about a penis, aren't you, Alistair? Charming. Uh, how do you know I'm a warden? A combination of my research and blood magic. What? Even without that, who else would brave soldiers peak? There's some, apparently, I want answers. To what questions, I wonder? Ask. Apparently the time for questions is now over. <laughs> uh, Levi, yeah, you want to say something? Master Mage, uh, sir, my family name has been worth less than dirt for over a century. Do you have any proof that Sophia was a hero? The boy who braved the mists. So you heeded my call. <laughs> and you are a Dryden. The Cosmos has a sense of humor. Cosmos? Like, there are some words that they say in this game that I don't... It makes me doubt whether or not I've ever heard a British person say the, the, the word before. And I'm like, do they call... Do British people call it Cosmos? We go with Cosmos. I, wh whatever. Um, just answer his question. Your great-great-grandmother was the best of us. Brave, charismatic, fiery, utterly devoted to the fight. But still we lost. Because you we suck. We fought against a tyrant, you know. So full of vigor then, so blind to consequence. But proof? There's none to be had. All right. Time for question is over. So be it. My only request... If justice or vengeance drive you, stay your hand until the demons are dealt with. Fair enough. Demons must be stopped now. I'm not calling you my ally. We must go to the Great Hall. There, I will repair the damage I caused so long ago. There will be peril. The demons will fight us every step of the way. Oh no. Come. Not the demons, the things that I've been taking on this whole time. Alright, so we have... Yeah, we have some stuff to find in here. Yes. Ice arrows. Those are... Those are good for me. And we also have a corpse hanging on the wall. Hooray. And a wooden crate. With a helmet with nothing that I want. Hooray. What's the corpse got on him? Yes. And I think that is actually the, the last... Thing. Yep, I learned about the establishment of the base and its founders last days. The record states that Commander Asturian may have built secrets into the base and may have hidden something uh, important somewhere in Soldier's Peak. You found the clues, but where do they lead? Can we look at the, the codex real fast? Um, yeah, you have to read like all four of these. Uh, pretty much they give you a hint that uh, there's something here on the base, um, but th they don't really tell you where. That that's what the hint says. Like I said, I went over this before. Uh, but here, here we go. The sword will remind you what it is to be a warden. Speak your oath to me. When the shadows come, you must speak the words. That's how you're supposed to know um, where to find it. So you, basically, you hold tab in every room until you find something right. that you didn't see before. 
That's the best way I can put it. Okay, just glitch right on through the door. What do I care, Avernus? Avernus. Kind of like Avernus, because it sounds more like Avarice, which is definitely something he is guilty of. Alright, uh, we don't need to wait for him. So, I'm running. It works out better that way. I don't even have Rally on. <laughs> I don't need it. Uh, it does make things a lot easier, though. But it's annoying. We must act quickly. The demons are clawing on the gates. The veil must be closed. All right, I'm ready when you are. I will unravel the summoning circles I drew so long ago. Waves of spirits and demons may come through. Dispatch them. I will begin. All right, you go ahead and First, begin. I must summon the magical energies. I feel them. They're coming. No, they are coming. You didn't say it right. Uh, you know... I didn't, I didn't even need him to tell me what to do the first time. So how, why am I going to need him to tell me what to do this time? Uh, obviously, he only needs me to fight off demons. That's his whole purpose here. Um, do I even get a heal between? Like, no. No, I don't get a heal. Okay. Uh, but every time, you know, he seals up something. We have to take on another batch. Uh, he already sealed off one, it looks like. Levi, Levi, whatever his name is, he is not going to help. Of course not. Now we can take on this guy. And there we go. <laughs> you know, does it look like I need help doing this at all? Yeah, you go ahead and you speak your gobbledygook language. All right, there we go. There we go. Oh shit! Now I do need to heal. Boom! Full heal. <laughs> One's probably gonna do it though. That's all I'm gonna need. Hey, now hit that guy. And we're good. What do we got next? Desire demon? Is she by herself? Because if she's by herself, this is going to be ridiculously easy. I th she is! And I froze her in place for half this fight. <laughs> and down goes the desire demon. You done? He's done. All right, let me loot the desire demon. Anybody else drop anything? Oh, <laughs> there's Tab telling me how to complete my next quest. We'll do that a little bit later. Let's talk to him first. It's over. The veil is strong now. Stronger, at least. So what of me? Will you leave me to experiment in peace? No, I already got what I wanted. You've outlived your usefulness. So, betrayal. I shall not fall easily. Yes, yes you will. Huh. I don't think he even summons anything, if I remember right. He does cast Fireball, but of course, we are fine against that. I do need to use a group heal after that. Oh, he does summon something. He summons two... No, <laughs> doesn't matter. I got Once I kill him. Soldier's peak is safe again. Yay! A good thing you took care of that Avernus. A blood mage. In the wardens. Yeah, it happens. Common folk should never hear of that. Some still distrust wardens, even in a blight. Crazy buggers. I wouldn't There's trust no anyone proof else. to redeem my family. Uh, stuff your belly aching. Didn't mean to offend. You've done so much. Damn right I, I have. I suppose the next question is, what next? You've got a whole fortress now. It's about time. I suppose I should start plying my trade again. You have a trade? Farewell. If you ever want to talk again, I'll be here. And I'll have some of my wares to sell. Looks like we're done here. A demonic <coughs> invasion thwarted, a warden base safely rescued. We do good work. It is weird for him to have a smile like that. Oh, I still have to kill these guys. <laughs> Fair enough, so I get the cutscene in the middle of a battle. That's well thought out. The hell? Alright, what's up, Avernus? He's got incense of awareness and robes of Avernus. Improves blood magic, so probably not worthwhile. Uh, Levi, Levy, whatever. He says that um, he'll have a, a shop here. But you do need to leave uh, the actual entire area for that to happen. You can leave the room uh, and then come back and he'll actually... Well, I'll show that off, actually, because that's funny to me. All right. You found an old painting? One day back to Commander Asturian's times, perhaps Asturian's history points to this. 
recite the Grey Warden Oath, and there pops out the chest. So we have completed the side quest as well. This is apparently him, where you need to talk to him. What's in the stash? We do have a very nice sword. I don't remember if it's actually better than what I have equipped. Um, I know Charles can't equip it, but I, th I know Alistair can, so I'll have to check if it's good for him. Heavy chainmail's no good, though. I don't need the bolts. What am I going to do with bolts? I'll always take a belt, and I'll take the money, and that's a stash. Fair enough. Now, if I remember right, all I need to do is just leave and go through a loading screen. And if I head back to Levy, which I plan on doing right now, then there's a little bug, a little glitch with this that makes me laugh. Let me just save just in case it actually freezes my game. Uh, but it didn't last time I did it, so hopefully it, it doesn't this time either. Once my family comes, I might have some merchandise you can Oh, uh, fine. Alright, so apparently I have to actually leave the house, and that's too far. I'm not going to make you guys sit through that. Uh, what you do is you talk to him after you leave the house, but you don't leave the area. Um, and he will tell you that his shop is open, the place will look exactly the same. He'll he'll say how it changed, blah blah blah. Uh, so like his dialogue has changed as if you as if you've left even though you haven't left. And uh, he'll say, Hey, do you wanna look at my wares? And I'll be like, Yeah, let me see what you got and I'll just end the dialogue. <laughs> that cracks me up that there would be a bug like that in in this. And once again, premium content is done. That is it for this quest, which means that all of the premium content quests that I can do in Origins is done. Everything else is either a separate campaign or is in Awakening. So... Why can't I go back to Hongleith? Either way, we are, we're... Yeah, I'm done with Hongleith, aren't I? Uh, where do I need to go? I need to go to... Redcliffe Castle. In order to get this started, I need to tell Ah uh, Eamon that I am ready to storm upon Denerum. And I don't even need to go back to party camp and, and make sure everybody is fine or anything like that, as far as I can remember. I might do that, though. No need to talk to this guy again. He does not have anything that I want. Um, I think he does have something that's like 130 gold, but I'm not spending that on anybody. Not even Morgan is worth 130 gold right now, and she's pretty much my most valuable character, considering that she does a lot of the damage, all the healing. I'm still not willing to spend 100 and something gold on her for a staff or something like that. 